from WFSB, this is an Eyewitness News Update. Hello, everybody. Roger Suzanne in here with a check of some of our top stories on this Thursday morning. State regulators have approved another electric rate hike for both Eversource and United Illuminating customers. The higher rates are to cover $80 million worth of enhancements to the power grid for electric vehicle charging stations. And police in East Haven say they are being targeted in violent and unprovoked attacks. We're told police have dealt with several incidents where people have tried to provoke officers to chase them. In one of those incidents, a driver actually ran into a police cruiser intentionally. So far, no arrests have been made. Scott? Hey, Roger. We're getting a quick check of your forecast. The slightest chance for some severe weather towards northern Connecticut today. The Storm Prediction Center has highlighted uh, parts of our state with a level one risk for some severe weather. You'll see it play out on our first alert future cast. Throughout the morning hours, we're doing just fine. But those storms pop up 3, 4, even 5 o'clock through about sunset. As soon as sunset passes by, though, those showers and even storms diminish very quickly. We're looking at some hazy skies, though, to start your Friday. Temperatures on this Thursday, though, 80 to about 85 degrees. A bit cooler right along the shoreline and cooler if you get caught underneath some of these showers and storms. Your first alert seven day forecast. It's warm tomorrow on your Friday, 88 degrees. Humidity creeps up for the weekend. We have a first alert issued right now for a late day on our Sunday. Some unsettled weather likely at this point with that sticking with us. Even in the